Any of us offers a me. Broke in they pockets on E. On the big boss, we elite. Trust me, I say what I mean. We love them talkers and all. Living our life like a dream. UKN family, man. What's good with y'all, boys? In today's video, man, I will be showing y'all my fall slash winter lookbook, man. You don't already know what a fall slash winter lookbook is or a lookbook in general. A lookbook is just basically giving inspiration or, or ideas of fits for the winter or fall. Let's get straight into it. We're gonna go with outfit number one. So outfit number one includes this crop jacket I got from Minimal. So yeah, this is the main piece of the outfit, this will be outfit number one. Then we're going with this shirt right here. I got from PacSun. If you still buying clothes from PacSun, man, I commend you, because I haven't went to PacSun and bought something in a while, for being honest. Everybody dropping a brand, and everybody with a brand pieces, they, they shirt is kind of fired in the in-store, like, pieces, so. Hopefully that made sense. I don't know. Y'all tell me. But yeah, we are going with this shirt. Then we are going with these jeans. I did get from PacSun, man. Basically got a whole PacSun fit on. But that's what's the other point. So we are going blue jeans, white tee, and crop jacket for the first outfit. And our shoes are going to be... Um, I was thinking about wearing my forces with this. But I decided to wear my Travis Scott's. Those are my go-tos, man. So, yeah. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. I will throw a B-reel up right now. And I'm just about to talk over it. So, yeah. As y'all can see, this fit is kind of calm. Skinny jeans on me. Nothing too crazy. But it does get the job done. I like how I put the white on with the blue jeans and then... The black, the black jacket, cover, the cover up, and then the Travis Scotts, you dig what I'm saying? It's not nothing too crazy, just, just kind of like how I thought it was going to look. Came out how I thought it was going to look, actually. So, for the second outfit, I do have my famous flannel. This is my favorite flannel right here. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to just post a, my Instagram picture right here. Just because y'all already know I have a this flannel already. This is the staple piece. I feel like you always need a staple piece in your outfits, bro. Because it's like, if you have a staple piece, everything else doesn't really matter because you got that staple piece. So, you know, I went with the Supreme T for the shirt. So, then we go with the black skinny jeans from PacSign. Yes, I get all my jeans from PacSun. Hopefully for the kicks, I go with my Lot 50 Dunks. Y'all already know I'm about to throw a B-roll up on the screen of my outfit. And I might throw some pictures in here too. But yeah, y'all, have worn this outfit before. This was my favorite outfit, but I have more outfits now that I really enjoy. But that is still in my top five favorite outfit. So... Yeah, the flannel is more of a fall, a fall piece. It's not really a winter piece, so that, and then the jeans makes it look really good. And this, like, when I posted the pictures on Instagram, they did come out really nice, cause I was in Atlanta when I did take those pictures. So yeah, let me know what y'all think about that outfit in the comment section below. What would you change differently? Or what would you add to the outfit? Or would you even wear the outfit? Or any of these outfits I'm about to show y'all. So, outfit number three. A plain old Nike jumpsuit, man. As y'all can see, this isn't behind me. But it's just a jumpsuit. I don't have any crazy jumpsuits yet in my collection. But I have been thinking about getting some. Because when it does get cold outside, you don't want to dress up all, all day, every day. You feel what I'm saying? You just want to... Go outside, maybe put some easy slides on, or these good fellow slides I got right here. I got these slides from Target, bro. These slides right here are so comfortable, bro. So, this is outfit number three. It's a regular old jumpsuit. Hey, if y'all haven't already, go to Target, go pick up them good fellow slides, bro. They get the job done every time. I think that I got the gray colorway. I do think they have another colorway that's like a brown. I've been seeing pictures of the brown. That might just be my next color. I ain't gonna lie. 
because I needed another pair. They feel so good on my feet, bro. Compared to Yeezy slides, I'm going with them for sure. I'm going down for the Yeezy slides, but yeah. Yeah, man, this jumpsuit is not very kind. It's all black. I need some more crazy colors in a jumpsuit, though. So if y'all got some places that maybe sell jumpsuits or sell whole outfits, man, y'all let me know in the comment section below because I do need some. And what would y'all change differently? And what would y'all add to this outfit to make this outfit even better? So, yeah, man. And if you got a brand, man, don't be scared to DM me. Cause oh I might DM you cause I'm hey I'm trying to I'm trying to get a I'm trying to get a whole outfit going man cause I need some more comfortable pieces in my collection my collection right now is more like more like jeans and a little bit of sweats I'm trying to get more into sweats cause it's finna get cold bro I can't put on jeans every day can't put on jeans every day I need to be on some more chill ready to go like just throw on some sweats and then go. Feel what I'm saying? So on to outfit number four. We have the staple piece again. I have this sweater I thrifted from a Goodwill, bro, and I just cropped it. This sweater is insane, bro. It feels so good. I always wear a t-shirt under it. I might go white tee or black tee. Then we go with these black jeans I got from Hollister. These are my favorite jeans, bro. Do your homework on Hollis and James Twin. Do your homework. Uh, hey, I don't wear purple brand. I don't wear all that designer jeans, but do your homework on Hollis and James, big bro. You did what I'm saying? But those jeans are very comfortable, bro. I'm gonna be completely honest, bro. For my shoes, I did go with Trav's. Only reason I went Trav's is because this is kind of like the shoes I wanted to wear with this, I don't have them yet. But I feel like this outfit will look 10 times better with some Ricks. Or with some like Balenciaga defenders. So, yeah. And like, most of these outfits you don't have to wear like, name like big designer brand shoes, but I just feel like this outfit will look really good with some Rick on. So, I think that's my next show. I'll have to cop for the fall slash winter. But, uh, this outfit was very calm to a really do their bit to the max. I'm not gonna lie. And Rick's. Would have sat perfectly over the skinny jeans and then it would have been trunk. You dig what I'm saying? But this outfit is very calm. I really like how the sweater looks. It, look, it really looks like a mohair sweater, to be honest, in my own opinion. But y'all let me know in the comment section below. Is it mohair? I don't know. I just thrifted it and I really liked it. And I cropped it. So you know how I feel about crop tees, man. But yeah, man. On to the last and final. Outfit, it's not Carhartt. No, bro, it's not. It's not Carhartt. Not really expensive, but I got this as a Christmas present. So I was like, dang, why not? And it's giving like fall vibes. You did what I'm saying. So this kind of is like Carhartt rip, like, but it's a Wrangler. Ain't nothing wrong with Wrangler, man. but it's auto, and it come with like the little furry inside. So you don't even gotta do too much to stay warm. You did what I'm saying. This is like, this is really a fall vibe. The color, how it feel, how heavy it is. It got fur on the inside. We are going with this for the staple piece of this outfit. Then up under it, we are going with a just plain white tee. Nothing too crazy. The only reason why I went with white tee is because I would go a darker, like a darker brown. Or, I don't know, I kind of don't know what I would wear with that, to be honest. Because the jacket really going to be, like, zipped up and everything. It's, like, more, more of a cold type of fit. Then we go with these jeans right here. I don't even know where I got these jeans from the whole time. They are, like, some black washed. I don't like black overly washed denims. I don't know where I got these from, actually. But these jeans do get the job done, man. And then for my shoes, I feel like this outfit would really look good with like some military boots or the Yeezy Y3 boots. If I said that right, hopefully, hopefully I said that right. The Yeezy like, the Yeezy like commander boots, like the military looking boots. Like yeah, this outfit would look really good with that. 
Hopefully I can find my pair. This outfit does look really good with boots. And it's not nothing too crazy. It's just giving a more fall vibe. More, I'm trying to stay warm and still look fly. A good, not a good type of style. You feel what I'm saying? But yeah. Yeah, man. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video, man. It's your boy, Hot Tyler. Hopefully you guys did get some inspiration, ideas, or I helped you like gain a more understanding of what you can wear or what you could wear in the fall slash winter. Uh, let me know if y'all have any questions in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with your friends, your mom, your auntie. I don't care who you share it with, man. Let me know in the comment section below what video should I do next. If y'all haven't already, like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy Hot Tyler, and I'm out. Mm, mm, mm. These niggas tough as a meat.